Welcome to Zanternal Radio, where we drop truth gems all along the way. This is a short episode, but it's also a special episode, and it's dedicated to the nonsense that happened at the 2022 Oscars. Let's get into it. These are the top reasons why you shouldn't care about the Will Smith and Chris Rock issue. So reason number one, everybody in that auditorium was is at least a millionaire. And... That's just real truth. They're already successful. So what do you have to feel a certain way and feel sorry and oh my goodness, this happened. You know, focus on your own lives. They always hit us with these distractions and Satan wants to do that to distract you from your purpose. These people are millionaires. So we already know it's nonsense. Reason number two, the Oscars had low ratings. So this altercation boosted the ratings and it's the fact. Last year, I think for the past couple of years, uh, it's supposedly been run by black people. And so it's a, it's, a, it's, on, it's a shame that stupid things have to take place. Uh, and then you can say that, well, then black people are running it. They're being silly. And this is the left. This is the woke movement. Look at the Oscars. It's buffoonery. It's, it's nonsense. Just to boost the ratings, they have to have some drama. Reason number three, Chris Rock had already planned to go on tour. Um, but since the altercation, he has actually sold out tickets to his tour now. So after all of a sudden he gets slapped and all of a sudden, uh, now his, his whole show is sold out. So, um, you can say if it's planned or not, it seems pretty planned because now the guy's going on tour and it's already sold out and people want to side with him. Like he's a victim. He's not a victim. People. Reason number four, Will says he wants to be a vessel for love, but he also slapped somebody. Uh, right after he slapped somebody so uh, big question there that's not what love does love doesn't hit anybody so that's a that's a that's a red flag right there Hollywood the reason number five Hollywood runs many rituals for fame and money they're all actors uh, these rituals take place because again it's all about money and fame the world is run by money and whenever you, you if you just look around everything comes back to money people do everything for money um, this is what these societies are built on. These cities are built on. It's all gossip. It's money. It's nonsense. This is what they do. They do everything for money as well as to confuse the people and to make sure that you're distracted. And, um, yeah, they, they want you to focus on their lives. They're so selfish. They want you to focus on their lives and they don't want you to focus on your own lives. You know, you guys all have your own problems and your own issues in your own lives. Focus on that. Why turn on the TV and be bewildered and focusing on somebody else's nonsense? Again, that is, they're only there for money, fame, and riches, which is nonsense. Most people don't know these people like we know of them in media, but we don't actually know these people. So why do we care? That's a great question, a simple question. Why do people care about people they don't even know? Like, you don't actually know these people, bro. How they feel, what they think, how they move. Like, you know what I mean? Why? Why even care? Now, reason number six, um, I guess if, if people were tuning in and seeing. Again, I only saw clips. I didn't actually watch it. But even Denzel was tearing up and Will Smith was crying, right? Tearing up, etc. Uh, again, he even told you it's not because of the word. And he didn't even cry because of his actions. He was crying truly because of they understand they've been, they've been in the, that industry for decades they know the rituals they do they know what they have to do and they sold their soul to be rich and famous that's the notoriety they wanted uh to deal and to be part of this satanic hollywood club uh these are the same people that are shrub shoulder to shoulder with jeffrey epstein uh harvey weinstein bill cosby etc etc there's so many of these names these are the people and the things they do, the pedophilia rings, rings, the wicked satanic practices, it's all what they do. That's why they're crying. So when the dude's up there getting an award, he's crying because of, he knows everything he had, he's, he's had to go through and what he does. And they keep the secrets. So I have no respect for these people. You shouldn't either. Um, it's just nonsense. Now let's jump into something spiritual now. And I'm going to read from First Peter chapter 3. 1 Peter 3, 
verses 10 to 12. For who among you delights in life, longs for time to enjoy prosperity? Guard your tongue from evil, your lips from any breath of deceit. Turn away from evil and do good. Seek peace and pursue it. For the eyes of the Lord are upon the upright. His ear turned to their cry, but the Lord's face is against those who do evil. I sincerely hope you enjoyed this episode, this special episode. Um, consider following, liking, sharing, doing whatever you can. Spread the word about Zenternal Radio, ZenternalMusic.com. Visit us at ZenternalMusic.com. Listen to music, support the channel, support the website. If you like the music, you can always purchase. You can stream on your favorite uh, streaming platforms, Spotify, etc., etc., etc. All the platforms. I'm not going to list them. There's just too many. And um, just peace out until the next time. We will catch you guys at some time down in down the road in the future. So peace and shalom. Zen Turner Music, Zen Turner Radio, and we out.